Hi everybody, welcome back. I'm back in Cornwall now. Light's a bit bad here though, isn't it? Oh, that might be a bit better, but no. There, that looks a bit better, doesn't it? Yeah. <coughs> back in sunny Cornwall now, and it has been sunny all day. Been absolutely beautiful although i've actually done nothing done nothing at all all day apart from trying to mess about on this notebook i got from my brothers well off my nephew really which i'll show it you power it up there you go Well, you see a lot. Turn it off. Save electricity. And that's if you'll see in the van. There we go. On my new fan table there. That me and my brother built. The other table's down there on the floor. And you'll see Darren. I have installed that light bulb you gave me. Nice and bright again there. Nice rented camper van there. so yeah nah like i say back in cornwall after an absolute fucking beastly drive back last night so i set off from cleethorpes thinking it would be easier all the way down the motorway but the sat nav started to di redirect me in other directions because it was chock a block on the m1 apparently because I use Waze, it picks that up automatically and redirects you. Although, what a flaming nightmare. Sent me up the A38. Come off the M108, a bit on the M18. Then I just got onto the M1 and it turned me off that onto the A38. Absolute nightmare it was. Flaming nightmare. And to add insult to injury... Then it took me onto the M6 toll road. What can I say about that? How much do you think it actually cost for me to go on the toll road? Hey, I'll show you. I've kept the receipt as a memento. Don't know whether you'll see that. £11.30 pulled up to the toll booth the lady never said anything so I passed her a fiver and she went no that's £11.30 please sir honestly couldn't believe it £11.30 and then even to make matters worse as I passed through the toll booth, I looked down at my sat nav and it said, turn off in 11 miles onto the M42, I think it was. Or was it? Might have been. Can't remember. Actually worked out a pound of flaming mile. Well, just over a pound a mile. Shocked I was. Absolutely shocked. So I never got back into Cornwall till one minute past five in the morning. I landed back on this campsite. So I've done nothing all day. Well, apart from do that light bulb. Did that. So now, 
and all in total, what did I do? I did seven miles short of 1,100 miles. From Cornwall to Nottingham, Nottingham to Skegness, Skegness to Cleethorpes, Cleethorpes to Cornwall. Seven miles short of 1,100. I think I worked it out, it cost me £190 in diesel to do that. I don't suppose it were too bad. Just sounds a lot, doesn't it? £190. But now, nah. so I've already made use of this table, Darren. I will put the other table up when I have my dinner later on. I might not have no dinner. I might just eat crisps and biscuits tonight and cans of Coca-Cola. I can't work this damn laptop, well not laptop, notebook. That video editing has baffled me. Really has baffled me. So, looks like I'm starting work on Monday as well. It's a recovery place. Recovering broken down vehicles or whatever they want recovering for. Delivering them and that. Get some funds together again. Ready for the massive rebuild. And it will be rebuilt this beginning of next year. Total and utterly refit everything out and all new stuff in. Do it right. I suppose I did refit it in a way. Refitted two tables. Well, no. Added two tables. Now, if anybody's got any suggestions about how to refit vans, please feel free to comment. So I was going to tongue and groove all the roof. But it would take five packs to clad the roof out and the weight of it. I want everything lightweight. Fed up with this van being too heavy. It's not overweight, but I'm sure I can cut down a hell of a lot on the weight. So that's it for now. Like I say, I am back in Cornwall. I think I've shown you. Back in my spot. Mm. See if I can. No, nope, for some reason, won't let me enlarge it. Bit bloody mean, isn't it? That usually does. I won't do it. No, won't do it. Never mind. There. Good old Cornwall. And yes, I am absolutely over the moon to be back up here. Feel like I'm home now. Well, I am home. But I definitely couldn't live in Nottingham. Too busy. Way too busy. And Skeggy, Skeggy, Skeggy. Lived in Skegg and Mablethorpe for quite a few years. Not much fun down there. Some nice people. But it's not for me. Cornwall's life for me. Cornwall van life. Might attempt to try and refit them panels to the side of the van tomorrow. Go and get some silicon. Try and silicon on or something. Although, a good blessing, when I start at this garage on Monday, he'll sort it out for me. So I can't do it. So that's a good bonus. And try and get all the little niggly jobs done. On it. But there's, there's no jobs to be done. But get another cheap oil change and all that. Right. I'm going to get off now. I shall put another video up shortly. So all take care. Have fun. Don't forget. Recommend my channel. Give me shout outs. Give me anything. I need more subscribers. I think I've only got. I can't even remember how many I've got. Don't forget the Facebook. Page as well. Van Dwelling UK. Anyone's welcome to join it. 
as they are my YouTube channel. So be your good day now and all take care. So don't forget folks, you've got one life, fucking live it. Yeah? Right, bye de bye.